last one at Austinport. But what he did on this metal ground, he was referencing a Leonardo da Vinci a drawing of a uh, uh, deaf riding a horse. But what happens here is uh, deaf. Who is deaf? Is it the horse? Is it the person? The person is an African American who uh, seems to sit fragmented because he lost his leg. You just see one leg in the end. You, uh, it's very unclear the situation of the hands. But what happened to the horse? It's totally disassembled. So the horse is actually uh, cannot carry the body of the person above. So it's the fundament is breaking apart. So everything you know, like what you knew, what you were uh, thinking of, what you were believing in, is kind of falling apart. So there is no deaf riders or anything like this. There's just a dis uh, disassembled skeleton of a horse and this person who seems to be riding a not existing horse. But it has been done, painted during the last month of, the, of, of his the life. The last uh, half year of his life, yes. Does it mean something? I don't think so. I think it is really very much relating to art history and relating to the question of racism, the question of the position of African American in society. Uh, so there was no premonition? I don't think so. The last work he did was on a yellow background, a monkey, a monkey in a circle, uh, which was referencing uh, the way people were insulting Basquiat often as the wild man, the monkey. How he is also referring to in many of his interviews. Merci.